Hello everyone, welcome to Disastrously Domestic. We are doing a special episode today where we are going to the Vashon Sheepdog Classic on the lovely Vashon Island. I've got my husband here. Hi. I've got my Warren back there. <laughs> oh my god, you're a lunatic. Bagels. 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 Okay. Um, we're going to be driving to the ferry stopping at McDonald's for some health food and um, parking our car. We're not going to be taking our car on the ferry this time around, so yeah. Warren, what are we doing right now? Where are we going? Going go where? Going on a fish. Look, we're almost there. There's a boat. There's another boat ferry boat. In particular, you might want to look at paw prints genetics booth. There are a lot of genetic conditions that are carried by dogs. Um, some of them are fairly breed specific, but whatever your dog, you can get some genetic tests to see if they have anything that might be something you'd want to take into consideration on making breeding decisions or um, on how what kind of nutrition for your dog in the trial field. Alyssa and Trent Rose have completed the portion of the trial of the course called the drive and she is oh, asking Trent oh, Rose to, oh, <laughs> to bring the sheep into the shedding ring. And the sheep's like, what the hell? <laughs> Why'd you do that? <laughs> oh, look. Unfortunately, the sheep split off. We were seeing Primos do a very masterful job of backing the sheep up. Oh, no, oh, no. Uh oh. So that brings Trey and Rose and Alyssa Bowes run to a close. Border region. But shepherds traditionally have used sheep dogs in Great Britain for centuries. And they still use them. Wherever you find sheep raising throughout all of Great Britain and Ireland. The border collies have been bred specifically to be able to do certain things. And these trials are open to anybody and any breed of dog, but you will see the majority of them are border collies because they are the dog that is naturally able to do these tasks. <laughs> But if the dog has a lot of stress, they're, they do a better job. So, so you'll see people that would have a bad run, like a hundred degrees at four o'clock in the afternoon, that would have had a good run. If they ran at eight in the morning and it was cool. Right, but then you'll also see other teams yeah. that manage to be on top of the pack, no matter what time of day they run. <laughs> So Richard asked me if there was suddenly a thunder outburst and the dog did um, still did well, would they get extra points for dealing with the thunder? And the answer to that is no. However, the judge, there, this is not so cut and dried on judging. There are guidelines and rules, but there's a, a big element of the judge's own um, 
look at how everything's going. Let's see if you can get him in. So if something got wrong at the moment with the clap of thunder, many judges would be a bit more lenient on their deduction there than they would otherwise because they see that. Oh yeah. They will see that. It Nicely done. Ball decorations. Can you see? They're backlit. Whatever. Acquisitions. <laughs> Look at this. It glows. Really? Gorgeous. <laughs> <laughs> Like what he did, but like, like, like the big, biggest star in this oh. world ever. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Look, look, look. Do it. Are you watching the doggy? Yeah. Oh, in so the field, look, he's getting the sheep. Let's see, but that's the missing way <laughs> Like, even bigger, I think that. What? Because I wanted the sheep for coming. the slowest walk up a hill I ever saw in my life. Uh, I got more. Yeah. Hey, hey, don't chat Fluffy me. stuff. <laughs> oh, look at it. So good.
It's a little too windy. <laughs> falafel. What did you think of the falafel? Too spice. Ah, so spice. <laughs> what do you think of your haritos? Not spice. Is that also so spice? Very nice. <laughs> Seriously? It's raining. Go figure. The fairy has booze. My son has been obnoxious all day. <laughs> And um, sometimes drinking happens when that's the case. Oh, that's big. It tastes nasty. the ferry we're walking to our car and look there's a tiny house it's like my goal in life right there and they're taking it to the island how perfect is that <laughs> Thank you.